Hey guys, what's up? Welcome back to Touch App Reviewers. In this video, I have a quick little app review for Alto's Adventure for the iPhone and iPod Touch. Now this application is fairly new, I think, or at least it's new to me. And uh, it's, I think, 99 cents in the App Store. I think that's what I got it for. Um, but it's being advertised by Apple on the homepage as one of the great games. And it is really good. So uh, I'm going to start it here. All you do is tap to start. And uh, this game has really nice visuals. Um, if I pause it real quick... Uh, goes away but you can see my goals uh, pick up a magnet uh, ride through a village uh, land 25 backflips in total I've done all of that um, so it's gonna level me up after this uh, to level 8 and uh, see it's got a little asterisk next to it I don't know if you guys can read that but it says level will increase uh, at the end of next run so at the end of this run it will level me up and give me three new goals so I will show you guys that uh, once I crash which should be pretty quick because I am trying to play behind the tripod here but what you do is you try to pick up all these coins and also hit the llamas. So you're basically capturing them. Oh, I hit the rock. But uh, you're trying to get capture all the llamas because they have escaped. So here we go. It's going to level me up. I'll just show you that. I'm now level 9, so I have to ride through a forest, wake an elder, and score 1,500 trick points in one run. That should not be too difficult to do. It gives you a breakdown of what happened, and pretty much nothing happened that run because I crashed pretty quickly. So let's try again. So this game is different from other games where you're on like a, a board like this. This one, um, it seems like it's a little bit more difficult to do two in a row of those um, uh, backflips. I'm not really sure why they've uh, implemented the physics the way they have, but it's still fun nonetheless. So I would just, I usually like to do like two, two of them in a row, it just feels better, you know, in the air. But it's really difficult to do that in this game, so jump over the rocks you want to avoid those and there's also um, like I said elders there's like these camps with like dudes that chase after you and uh, you want to get away from them there we go awesome jump there going through a forest this should unlock the achievement maybe you can get up on these things and ride get some extra points and I hate that I hate when it crash lands like that like it totally should have landed that but uh that's one of my complaints about this game is how it uh chooses whether or not you've landed um i think it should be a little bit more forgiving on that because watch this oh it actually did it and uh, as you can see when it did that it had like a little force field in front of him and uh, that just means that you can hit a rock and be fine so it's kind of like an extra shield kind of thing but the graphics are really nice and as you keep playing it does get dark and you know it, it changes the time of day and stuff so the graphics do look really nice the sound effects are really nice too obviously I have them off because this is a video but um, yeah hit that rock <laughs> but that's the app it's called Alto's Adventure if you like these types of it's basically an endless runner uh, if, with um, some achievements and stuff so if you like that type of game definitely check this out the graphics like I said are really great and the sound effects are too so um, check it out it's 99 cents, linked in the description, and uh, as you can see, it's dimming now. It's turning nighttime on this game, so uh, yeah. See you guys in the next one. Don't forget to subscribe and like this video. Peace.